Well, hello, Harry, and thank you so much for taking this time today to have this exciting conversation regarding partnering with NIAX. Um, we're looking forward to a very successful relationship with you moving forward and also plan to learn much from you and your constituents that offer customer support. Um, so that's going to lead me right into my next question naturally, that who is NIAX? Well, thank you, Kim, for having me. I, I enjoy speaking to groups. Um, uh, I love educating on who NIAX is. Um, NIAX is quite a unique company. Uh, there is no company actually in the world that does what NIAX does to the breadth of NIAX. And what do I mean by that? NIAX is a global engineering company. We actually engineer the readers ourselves, these readers and the back end reporting systems uh, including inventory management, et cetera, are all developed by us, by our engineering team. And we're on, um, I believe it's over 400,000 unattended machines in 60 plus countries around the world. Uh, we bank with 45 financial institutions. We take 26 currencies. So one will find NIACs on every kind of unattended machine all over the world, whether that be vending, car wash, air and vac, uh, massage chairs, amusements, uh, photo booths, smart machines such as electric vehicle charging stations, kiosks, et cetera. So uh, because we're a, a global engineering company and these are all, all our own readers, why does that matter to your customers or to our customers or to anybody who doesn't even know NIAX exists and sh should have the NIAX conversation? It matters because we, being the engineering company of its own equipment and most uh, uh, companies out there are not the engineering company over their own equipment. They are buying their hardware from uh, OEM manufacturers, meaning uh, uh, basically uh, outsource companies, and they put their names on it and they resell it. And there's nothing wrong with that. You're going to get a reader that's going to take credit cards and going to take phone payments. And that's sort of like the basics. That's what we all do. When you buy from NIAX, because we engineer these, ourselves, we pack them with lots and lots of features to help our operators make additional funds. So um, I'll give a few examples of those. You do have videos that you can share with your customers that actually visually display a lot of this. But um, one of the areas that makes NIAX stand out is today a lot of customers are being bombarded with emails consider, uh, concerning uh, um, uh, EMV readers or, or tap readers or chip readers, et cetera. It was in 2017 when Visa and MasterCard said, we don't want anybody using magnetic swipe anymore. Magnetic swipe is that stripe that's on the side of your card. Well, that, that's what everybody had been used to in the United States for many years. Well, the, they, they didn't want anybody using it because everybody has the chip on their card. They've had it for many years. And you can't steal the chip. You can't, there's not going to be chargebacks with chip. Uh, and that chip technology I, I referred to before, that's e, called EMV standard. So uh, as a result of Visa MasterCard not wanting anybody to use those stripes anymore when they buy to avoid uh, uh, stolen cards and chargebacks, the retailers in the United States all converted over. And that's why four and five years ago, you could have gone into Walmart or restaurants or Target, et cetera, and you could have swiped that card and you could, and, and that, that was the norm. Today, you'd be hard pressed anywhere in retail to find any point of sale terminal that's gonna allow you to do anything but insert your chip. And if you're fortunate enough to have the four, the four wave symbols on the back of your card, if everybody were to flip their card or look on the back of the card, if they have those four wave symbols, that means that they're able to also wave their card in front of the reader. And that, uh, that waving is the same as inserting. It's faster, but it's as secure. They're both considered EMV transactions. So uh, what people don't know is outside the United States, every country has been on EMV or chip standard, security standard for many years, long before the United States. So now we've got the, uh, the whole world on EMV, except for unattended machine owners. Your customers and just about everybody else who's been buying on car washes, on air and vacs, vending machines, of course, over the past years have been sold magnetic swipe readers. So uh, NIACs, because we're EMV certified all over the world, we support the world 
um, and the world is all EMV, we brought the chip reader to the United States four years ago. Um, so anybody who's been buying from NIACs the past four years would have already had uh, a chip. They would have already had swipe. I'm sorry, they would have had uh, um, chip and they would have had uh, wave if they had the four wave symbols on the back of their card. And they wouldn't have to deal with all these upgrades that they're being told they have to do today and have to spend all this extra money. Um, that wouldn't have been necessary. So again, why did NIACs have a uh, uh, chip and tap and all the, the security features years ago and everybody else is playing catch up today? Again, because NIAC, this is our reader. We're the engineering company. We do it for the world. Everybody else, just about everybody else, they're, um, they're just outsourcing and, and uh, buying their hardware and to come out with an EMV certified reader is a, a very, very long, expensive process. There's a lot of in, a time involved in the certification and they're all coming into it very late. So uh, that's just one example of what NIAX offers. Right. There are many more that I'll briefly go through. And these are features that don't cost customers any more than the features the other companies sell them that are what I call the more plain vanilla reader. IAX right. has the, full, the fully featured reader. So what, what do we add into the technology that helps our operators? Um, when your machines fail, when they lose power and they go down, right now, unless you, you're in a very specific type of software program that most people won't have, you're in a situation where you're relying on a manual process to know that you're losing business, meaning that a customer has to call you from the location, say, hey, your machine's down. Or you have to be watching your sales reports very closely to see that you're not doing sales. In both those cases, you're down for a period of time. And the more machines you have, the more likely you're down over some period of time. So what does NIAX do? We have a capacitor in all of our hardware. That means that the second any machine on any kind of machine, our reader on any machine, anywhere in the world goes down, that machine goes down, within a half a second, you get a power down alert by text and by email. You know instantly that your machine went down, you have to do something about it. And let's say that it comes right back up. Let's say it's just uh, a surge in the building or someone accidentally knocked out the plug when they were vacuuming a location at midnight. So you got the power down alert that you're down and then it came right back up. We send a power up alert as well. So you're always knowing within a second, the condition of your machine. Amazing. Um, when you all are installing, I don't know what operators we have here that might, might have more than a couple of machines, but you've encountered uh, locations that don't have good cell signal. All of these readers require you to have a strong cell signal and a consistent one. And if you happen to be in a building that's concrete or, or uh, steel encased, or it just might be a rural area or any area where a cell phone just doesn't have good signal. In those cases, you're, 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 block, you're, you're not getting an effective signal, a cellular signal, and you can buy what's called a high gain antenna. Maybe some of you have heard of that. And, and that might just boost it enough, but there are gonna be locations you can't boost and you're stuck in cash with all the stock readers in the market. You, you can't get a good signal, you can't do credit cards and phone. NIAX, we, we uh, built in an Ethernet and a Wi-Fi port. Mm -hmm. So th what that means is any uh, of our operators, if they encounter a location that doesn't have strong cellular, um, instead of being stuck in cash, if they have access to Ethernet in that location or Wi-Fi, they can still process transactions with our reader. Um, I'm going to move to what one of the most exciting areas of a NIAX reader, and that's customer engagement. Customer engagement is a term that anybody who is in the retail world knows. If you have a store, you wanna engage your customer. You're gonna, they're gonna come in, you're gonna greet them, you, you're gonna uh, talk to them if you can. You're certainly gonna say thank you at the end before they leave. That retailers know that if they, the best chance to get a customer to come back is to give them a pleasant experience and engage them. So unattended machine owners don't know what that term means because in an unattended machine, whether again, whether that's a car wash or a vending machine or a massage chair, whatever it might be, you put your money in, you use your credit card, you pay by phone, and you get your massage, you get your Hershey bar, you get your car wash, and you walk away, you're done. And that's not NIAX. We, we're all about customer engagement, and we build that as a part of the technology. So I'll give you a few examples how we engage customers. Number one, our readers speak. 
they actually engage the customer by voice through the transaction. Uh, at the end of every transaction, we say thank you. Um, and that's on every reader that NIAC sells. Um, so, th I mean, that's a nice thing to have. It, it's, it's, it's engaging the customers say, wow, the reader's talking to me. It's, it's, it's a pleasant experience. The newer device that we sell, it's called the VPOS Touch. That's a graphical display device. Um, that's, that's the device that has all the futuristic uh, uh, features that the big engineering company NIAX is gonna be putting in in the future and has a lot of advanced features today. It's probably the hottest reader in the market. That reader at the end of the transaction, not only says thank you, but it, 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 it um, a graphical, a high resolution graphical burst of thank you in 23 languages comes off the screen into the customer's eyes. Again, this is just a, a feel good experience for a customer. Now that's the beginning of customer engagement. That's not the whole customer engagement experience. We have an app called Monix, M-O-N-Y-X. That app is NIAX's rewards and loyalty app. It has, it has it's multi-featured and I'm gonna give you briefly both sides of the, of the coin. So on one hand, if you have the Monix app as an operator and you wanna invest a little bit of time, you can then do promotions. You can do buy X, get X free sales. You'll, you can engage your customer through the reward system, okay? So that's on the operator side. But let's say the operator is starting out or whatever and they don't have time and they're gonna deal with that part of the app later. They should be making sure that their customers are using that app, regardless of whether they plan on giving them rewards or not. Why? Jerry? Yes, please. Is it that app there? Monix Wallet, that's it. Thank yes, you, sir. sir. So that app, you want all your customers to have, regardless of whether you're gonna use it as, as a reward mechanism. And why is that? Because NIAX is giving them free money. Not you, NIAX, and I'll get into a lot more depth into that. So how, how does that work? So right now they're gonna download the app, they're gonna put their cell number in, they're gonna put their name in, and they're gonna register. Once they do that, similar to Apple Pay and Google Pay, they're putting money on a credit card and they're able to pay. But where it takes off is at, and they put different denominations in, right? And I'll give you an example of, of how this makes, uh, visually makes a lot of sense. Let's say you have a customer now. They, they like a candy bar, they like the Hershey bar, they're paying a dollar for that bar every day for 25 days. They, they, these are recurring customers, uh, especially after COVID, everything's gonna start recurring back again. We're gonna get everybody back. People are gonna be buying like they used to, et cetera. And, and, and you've got customers in this location, that every day they're spending a dollar and they get a Hershey bar after 25 days. They've uh, They've inserted, if it's a NIAX reader, they've inserted their chip or waved their card um, and they've gotten their uh, 25 candy bars after 25 days and you're probably paying your 5.95% processing fee as the operator. That's the way it works now. But if you, if you had them use the Monix app, then instead of them spending $25, which they're gonna spend anyway over a period of time, they can put $25 in that app and right on, the, as they get into the app, they'll see at $25, it says instant 10% bonus. So for every $25 they would have spent anyway, they put $25 into that app, they're gonna see $27.50. $2.50 free money that NIAX gave them just to use that app. And, and if they didn't use that app, they're walking away from, from $2.50 free money for every $25 they would have spent in your machines anyway. Okay, that's number one. We added a new feature. We have a big team on the Monix app. The Monix app is, is, uh, is all about the customer engagement that I said, and it's an important app for NIAC. So we're, we're building that out into a lot of features. So we added a new feature about four months ago. It's called the Shake Me feature. And, and again, Kim has many videos that display this visually. The shake me feature means that at the end of every single transaction a customer does, and let's say they did the $25 and they got the 250 bonus, whether they did that or not, at the end of every transaction, whether they bought a candy bar or whether they bought an energy drink or, or a car wash or whatever it is, the, the, the phone's gonna light up, it's gonna say shake me. And they're gonna go like this with their phone. And when they go like this with their phone, it's gonna drop money into the app. And the, um, it's all about customer engagement. Remember how I started? That's really cool. What's the epitome of customer engagement? 
they, everybody, especially the younger and even middle-aged people today, look at me, everybody's into the phones. So how much more engaging is it than to shake your phone and get free money? So um, the, the uh, video that uh, Kim has and can show you um, will display that the, the person got 11 cents. It could be a penny, it could be a nickel, whatever it is, they're getting free money after every transaction and they're doing it in a very engaging way. So that's another new exciting feature. So customer engagement is a very, very important facet of what NIAX does. Um, so the, I'm, 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 we're limited in time that I can't go into every single feature, but we have a, a very robust inventory management system. Mm -hmm. um, everything that we offer, we don't charge extra for. In other words, if you're with a different company now and you're paying your monthly fee, I'm pretty certain that you're going to be paying a very similar, if not identical monthly fee with NIAX and you're going to get all these features. We don't nickel and dime and charge extra for our features. All our features are built in. Again, we can do that because we're building the platform for the entire world. We're not just looking at the US. NIAX started as a global engineering company. So we're, as I said, we're in 60 countries and growing. Um, so I'm going to sort of stop at that point on that question as to who is NIAX. Right. Yeah, I think, um, yeah, so I think, you know, you've already answered all of my questions. So that's what's yeah, so great yeah. about your, how, you know, excited you are about your program. Um, I know from my first conversation with you, we were sold um, for a lot of reasons. The one question I had, though, is um, I know you had mentioned that when you buy the newest model mm -hmm. that, and correct me if I'm wrong, that future upgrades are free to the vendors. Yes. So when you say future upgrades, so the, the VPOS Touch is NIAX's platform for the future. Um, that's a device that is a touchscreen device. It's graphical. Um, it, it, uh, it allows you to brand. So in other words, right now you can have, um, it's scrolling graphics across the screen. One of the nice advan uh, advantages of it is that it, uh, our operators can have two of their own graphics on that screen. So if you wanna brand your logo, your uh, name of your company, your colors, uh, certain messaging, you can create P uh, ping fi PNG files and, and we can just, you can just put it right up on, on the screen and um, your customers will see whatever you want them to see as well as what NIAX needs to show them as well. Um, well and the additional feature, a lot of features in the future. Right, you know, I think um, it's obvious why we've chosen you as a partner. Um, however, could you enlighten us with why you've chosen us as a partner? All right, so there are, there are resellers out there and there are resellers, okay? So there are resellers who I, I um, call them order taker resellers. And then there are resellers that I call value added resellers. So the order taker resellers are ones that, hey, I want X device, give me two of them. And they'll say, great. And then they'll, they'll go move to the next customer. I'll take two uh, X you know, devices, great. Keep moving on and on. Just take orders and keep moving. Um, the value added resellers, and that's what stands out about uh, your company, as well as uh, as others that I work with, um, is that you care about your customer, that you're not gonna just stay with the same technology uh, or the same readers or the same history, regardless of, of your relationships, regardless of, of the history, you're, you're gonna look at the technology and you're gonna look at what's best for your customer as times change and as technology changes. And that's, that's what NIAX is all about. We're all about education ourselves. We, it, it, I can tell you that anybody that I personally speak to that has never spoken to NIAX before and they haven't used NIAX, I would probably say nine out of every 10 are gonna move to NIAX. Because sure. there's, it, 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 it almost doesn't make sense not to when you hear about who we are, what we offer and how we're unique and how we don't charge extra for it. Right, right, right. They know what they don't know, and that's what you you offer them that type of education. We love working with people like yourself. I'm hoping that you can see it with um, our new branding strategy. That what we are positioning us ourselves in is to be being known as the vending educator. 
Um, we've made some, I think, some huge strides this year. Um, thanks to Rick and and you know Sean here with um, our marketing strategy and and really coming up with a solid plan that we want everyone to be our customers or new customers their first call because of that reason. So as we move forward in the next few months, um, you'll again see more educational videos, um, you know, more active Q and A sessions. You know, Rick and I have talked about um, a chat line, an open chat line, um, but to bring in more staff as we speak to handle that. Um, you know, so, you know, and also, um, you know, machine sales are very important to us. And I think Sean can contest to that, whether it's refurbished or new. So we don't just give you a machine. Um, right now we're changing our warranty on our refurbished machines from 90 days to six months. So that tell you, tells you the trust that we have in our work. Um, we are creating a private customer portal of which that information will be shared. We are also in the thought process of um, making the video library um, or tutorial mandatory to uphold our warranty, uh, mainly because there are many, many customers and they're new, even our older customers, you know, well-established that have what we consider common practice questions. So my husband being the giving man that he is, he will spend hours on the phone and so are our service techs. Um, so we feel that this is just, you know, a great way to introduce them to the, the vending one, two, threes, right? Um, so I think that, you know, again, you know, I think our model ties into yours very, you know, very unifiedly, um, which is really what um, grabbed my attention from our initial conversation with you. It was a trusting, you know, very open conversation, which is, you know, I know we'll move forward in that in that light. Um, so we're thrilled. Um, I know Sean's already, you know, active and, and looking at the, uh, looking for more customers. Um, we have not announced this yet. My daughter who has a big marketing accounting background is coming on to the family business. So part of her role will be to identify accounts and what their needs are. And that she'll hit the ground running in three weeks with that idea. So I do feel that um, our sales, not only with you, but some of our other trusted partners are just going to skyrocket. I mean, I think that um, she's got the capability and she's, you know, it, 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 I swear when Mark told her it was, um, there were actual tears to his eyes. You know, he wanted to pass his business down as part of his living legacy. So um, we're, we're, you know, completely thrilled. Um, but I think with that said, I think this has been a very great conversation. I think that our customers are going to value this video. And, you know, Rick and I are in conversations right now on how to socially and, you know, customer interactively share this information, which of course we'll share with you prior to doing anything. Um, but I think, yeah, welcome. I mean, you know, welcome to our HRI family. Um, and at any time, we are a phone call away, whether that's Sean, me, or Mark. Um, and we'll do everything that we can to make sure those customers, as you do, are treated as loyal as they are meant to be. Well, I, I appreciate uh, uh, having the conversation with your with uh, the audience um, and everybody you're going to be sharing this with. Um, I'm excited about working, or NIAX is excited about working with, with your company. Um, and we're all about customer engagement. We're all about customer service. Um, I, I, I literally speak and, and I deal in, uh, between LinkedIn, Facebook, emails, voicemails, um, every medium that I'm on, I, I literally am dealing with probably 200 touches a day. And I enjoy speaking to people, I enjoy educating, and it's great to have partners like yourself, they'll do the same thing. Right. And, that, and that's why I've enjoyed our time. So thank you very much. Um, I think we've got some orders brewing as we talk. Great. So you will definitely be in touch. And, you know, again, call us anytime. Thank you very, very much. I look forward to working with you. Thank you. Have a great night. Sure. Okay, bye. Take care, Kim.